In this video, you will learn about how to edit view frames and match line and profile view style. Before starting, if you are new to my channel, make sure to subscribe it to get all the updates from my channel. Now, without wasting any time, let's get started. First, to turn off this match line masking, select your match line, match line, right click and go to edit match line style. In display tab, you can either change the color of the mask or you can just turn it off. Once you're done, simply click on apply to update. As you can see, now the match line masking has been removed. And now if you want to turn off the line, you can do that as well. Now we'll just keep the uh, line and click apply and OK. This is how you can turn off match line masking. Now to edit the profile view, you can simply edit the profile view style. Right click and go to profile view style. You can change a uh, vertical scale, horizontal, uh, vertical exaggeration and custom scale. Now let's change this uh, horizontal axis distance. As you can see, those elevations are popping in between the profile. Let's make it to display outside the profiles and to do that simply change the axis select the axis whether you want it on the right or on the left use minus sign for left side as you can see now the elevations are appearing outside the profiles go to right axis and specify the distance let's try a smaller value Now, in the display tab, you can turn on or off <clears throat> various components such as uh, left axis annotation, major left ticks, major minor ticks, uh, etc. Now to edit view frame or match lines, you can simply uh, use the grips. As you can see, if you want to uh, switch the view frame, you can use this diamond grip appearing at the center. You can type in the station value if you want, or you can use the AutoCAD snap commands. Now, once you click uh, your Label will update automatically. Now, similarly, you can make changes to match line as well. By selecting the grips, you can either move them to and or front in the direction, or you can type in the station value. So that's it for today's video. I hope you understood. If you like it, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. And We'll meet again in the new video. Thank you for watching.